you put in your car. I showed you that if you've put a thousand rands worth of petrol in your car, 340 rand of that goes directly to the government in tax. Now let's not forget that these taxes that we're paying at the pump is in addition to the income tax that we already pay. The fact that the garages pay company tax on all the profits that they make. Then there is the annual car licensing fees which we all have to pay every single year and then not to mention toll fees. And there are also an additional 54 direct and indirect taxes. Now let's take a look at the history of these fuel taxes. In 2011, the government collected 55 billion in fuel taxes. In 2021, that number is up to 135 billion. So if we look at the last 10 years in 2011 to 2021, there has been a 147% increase in fuel taxes. So if everything was fair and equal in society, that means that your income should have gone up by 147% in the last 10 years. That means if in 2011 you were earning 20,000 today, you should be earning 49,400. If you were earning 25,000 today, you should be earning 61,750. And if you're earning 30,000, you should be earning 74,100. And if you were earning 35,000 back in 2011, you should currently be earning 86,450. But let me explain this to you better with a picture. So let's assume government and us in 2011 started at the same place. Since 2011 to 2021, government is currently earning an extra 147% in taxes. The reality is most South Africans' income has only gone up by 37.5% in the last 10 years. And that means that government is currently taking an extra 109% of your money out of your pocket every single time you fill up petrol. And the reality is the South African government is literally taxing us into poverty. This nonsense has to stop. And the only way we're going to change anything is if we educate people. So I'm going to ask you again, please share this video here on TikTok, share it with your friends and family across your different social media profiles and send it on WhatsApp to every single person you know. And make sure you're following me by clicking that plus button here on the screen because I'm going to be releasing a lot more information like this and I'm doing a deep dive into what's going on at the Road Accident Fund as well.